All right, let's begin autonomous period in three, two, one, go. Both teams have bots that approach all of the sky blocks. Evolution immediately placing a sky block in their autonomous period. Brady Goats was able to pass a single sky stone underneath the bridge. Fortunately, it appears that Evolutionary Robotics has gotten stuck on the center post, and Blue Alliance has a double park. That is the end of Autonomous Period. Three, two, one. Now begins Driver Controlled Period. Both teams are immediately scooping up as many Sky Stones as possible. Blue Alliance has scored their first Sky Stone, about to score their second. Red Alliance already has two and about to be three Sky Stones. Team 967 has just started movement, immediately picks up a Sky Stone and heads towards... Oh, they are deploying blocks so that Brainstormers can immediately pick it up. Interesting use of transfer. Blue Alliance may likely be doing the same thing, except it's a coordinated double stack. Blue Alliance needs to shift over just a little bit to the left in order to position that Sky Stone. Oh no, and it unfortunately topples over. They were not able to get that triple stack. Red Alliance is currently at one toppled Sky Stone and four Sky Blocks tall. Blue Alliance has a stack of two, a toppled Sky Stone and a stack of three. About to be a double stack of three. We have less than a minute remaining in driver control period. Not counting end game. Oh, just a barely missed. Blue Alliance is about to score their ninth Sky Stone. They have to very carefully position that block, maybe a little bit to the left. Oh, and that begins the end game. Let's see. Brainstormers is about to get a six stack. Blue Alliance has a, a five stack and a four stack. Let's see what the teams will do. Brainstormers has already extended their tape measure. Red Alliance is in the corner. Blue Alliance barely pushing their... Oh, and they got the tape extender. Incredible performance by both teams. Woo, this is gonna be a... <laughs> 